Good evening everyone, Patrick here, Nowhere to Go Show. As you can see in the background, it is time for some Paradox Rift, the all new set um, for the Pokemon TCG, directly after 151, which is a wild ride that I'm still having trouble finding uh, product. I don't think I found a single booster bundle yet, but I've had some decent luck. Most recently when I was in Orlando, I got a Zapdos box and pulled the Zapdos Secret Illustration Rare. So, very happy. Today I'm just gonna open one of the boosters. If you've watched the channel before, you may know I usually save the two other two for friends. I do have both Pokemon Center ETBs as well. I'll open it in a later video, but I'm just gonna get right to this one and see what we can pull out of one. Again, I'm actually, uh, I wouldn't say overly excited for this set, but I think, this set where a lot of people are, it seems like they're passing on or they're going light on. I'm pretty excited to see uh, some of these future and ancient cards that I think are gonna be very meta here in the, in the for the TCG game. And it's gonna be great. So I'm hoping that we can, uh, again, have some great hits. Oh, I'm gonna go ahead and pull them all out. Pretty excited for this set. Um, Parasol Lady's probably my number one chase because that card looks great. But honestly, the Iron Valiant uh, Secret Illustration Rare, uh, well, the Hyper Rare looks so good. Um, so, but we're gonna get right to it. If, um, if you haven't yet, you know, definitely leave a like. If your first time on the channel, welcome. I pr appreciate you stopping by. Uh, of course, any subscription helps. There's a code card for you. You know, Water Energy. And we'll see if we can start out with something. Mantike, Gabite, Manun. Doublade, Countercatcher, Masquerain, Ancient Booster Energy Capsule. You get the Ancient with the new kind of design on the side. More Pekos, the first parallel. We got a Steeny parallel and a Sandy Shocks EX. So we're starting off with a hit. It's a very nice EX and it is an ancient one. You can see again the, the design coming through the side. So we'll pop this over here. And we're gonna keep these here. All right. All right. Got the Salamence or the, um, I'm already drawing a blank on what, what the, um, <laughs> the, the, the past for the ancient version, I guess you would call it is. Is that for you? With a little dark energy coming at you. All right. Let me throw this away. All right. And we got a Gimmigul. There is a fantastic illustration Gimmigul and Goldango that connect, actually. That is so sick. And I would love to see one of those in person. Vanillux, Tinkatuff, Vanillite, and a Tinglu as their first hollow rare. Very nice. And I've said I, I actually like the format of uh, Scarlet and Violet where you get the two, you know, parallels, and then you get the one guaranteed hollow foil or better per pack. I think that definitely justifies the 50 cent per pack increase. In my opinion, the hits have been a little nicer. Uh, at least a little easier to kind of complete most sets. I've seen concern with this set being kind of large, but it's really not larger than any other Scarlet and Violet set so far. Yeah, this is going to be a hard one to, to complete with as many great arts there as there is. Tender Mouse, Cyclos Art, Professor Turo, the secret illustrations on those are great. Me and Xiao. Ooh, Pumpkaboo parallel. Wow, and there we go. Our first illustration rare with a minier. I love how it literally just cascades across. Very beautiful. And a Volcanion is our holographic rare. So I love that. The way the feel looks on it. I know this is probably not even an expensive card. It just looks really nice. So our first illustration rare there. So we got an EX and a minier. The Sandy Shocks looks really cool. I believe there's the Sandy Shocks Illustration Rare. The Steelix looks amazing. There, honestly, there's more than I can even name. This is a beautiful, beautiful set. Uh, and I think um, people will gonna come back to this and look at it a little bit stronger. Let me know your opinions on it and what you're thinking. Defiance Vest, Durant, and first set that has had TMs in a long time. So Technical Machines are back. Onyx, Orocorio, and a Zatu. Fantastic. So yeah, our TMs are back. It's our first set with future and, and um, ancient cards. So there's a whole new mechanics that are gonna be starting in a couple weeks that are gonna be tournament legal. 
I think at this moment they are not because it just came out, but that's okay. Metal Energy. We got a Toad School, Toxel, Spinda, Nimble, Rika, is that Screamtail Ancients? Seda's Vitality, Ancients. Oh, Tinka Tink. Cyclozar Parallel, and a Groudon. Fantastic. This set has a lot of Ancients, or Legendary Pokemon. Let me say Ancient. A lot of Legendary Pokemon of newer, past. All right. Fancy code. I'm hoping to get, oh, I just think we're in the last card, Phoebus APOM. Um, as I always say, if you can get about 30%, so 12 would be ideal, more would be better. 11 is, I've seen plenty of times and have pretty strong cards. That Iron Jugulus is, look at that, with the shine here on the right with the future. That is a beautiful card. They've done a great job uh, so far with, I think just, implementing new things that are from the games in here. The second DLC, I think, drops December. I think they just came out with a date on that. So that's pretty exciting as well. Let's go. A little lightning energy. There we go. Elekid. Vanillish. No Onyx. Tink a tink. It's a regular minier. A beautiful one in the back. Crocolore. Ooh, tulip. Purloin. A grad on parallel, so parallel rare. Ooh, and a Zacium. So we've got some even sword and shield legendaries. I don't know if Zonzentis in this one. I think I only saw, you know, I haven't opened an ETB yet, so I haven't been able to look through the book, and I've kind of done a good job of staying away. I've watched a couple videos online, people opening them, and seeing a few different art. And again, I think it's quite nice. I think the Scarlet and Violet era, that's the been the pinnacle of art so far. Mill Tank, even the standards look really good. Ooh, the Absol is kind of crazy. Love it. Masquerain. Zatsu Parallel. Honage Parallel. And Espathra. Beautiful. It's not too often you see a trainer in a normal card. So here we go. So two hits, and we're about 25% through the box. There you go. A little dark energy. With a shark in it. Flittle, trubbish looking drunk on trash. Gimagool, Dondazo, Chantal, Garbador. Almost thought he was uh, using an incorrect finger there. Wimpod parallel, a Panpour parallel, and a Rourke. Full art trainer. That looks really good. Love it. Didn't even know this one was in it, but nonetheless, you know, I always collect trainers. One day I'm gonna have to show you my trainer binder. I nearly have every full art trainer that's ever come out. That's probably my favorite binder. Um, I nearly have every full art Pokemon, for the most part, starting with Sword and Shield, like that style full art. Yeah, I know there's full arts before, but um, that's a nice binder I'm really enjoying too. I used to try to keep all the illustration readers or I forgot what these call them, Sword and Shield in one binder, but that's become kind of a mess. So I'm just kind of keeping them in their own set binders now. Wimpod, Plusel, Tandem Mouse, Toad School in action, love it. Ancient Booster Energy Capsule, Orthworm, Toro Scenario, Utingu Parallel, Chantal Parallel, and a Galossipod. Beautiful. Next hollow rare. Wondering if we're going to get a hyper rare or usually in a booster. Uh, a booster in a. Yeah, it is a booster box. I've seen typically at least one secret illustration rare. No guarantee of a hyper rare, though, in many boxes I've seen at least one of those as well. Wiglet, at least me personally. Jirachi. Necklace, Parasol Lady again. Can't wait to see if we can pull the full art on that. Slitherwing, Ancients, Dottler, a Zubat Parallel, and Eveltal. Again, we're getting a whole wide range of these legendaries. And I don't know if it's because it's celebrating 
past and present. So it's kind of like, here's a little bit of everything. Either way, pretty cool. All right, let's see if this first half of this box can kick it up a little bit. As you can see, we've got just a handful of packs left in the first half and we're trekking well below, I don't wanna say well below, if we can get six before the half, that's ideal. Ellie Kid, Mian Shao, Rika, Nick Gorgeist, Joel Tick Parallel, looks nice. Natu, Anacophagragus EX, nice. So we've got our fourth one, let's get that in. That's pretty nice. So we got two EXs, a full art trainer, and one illustration rare so far. Not too bad. I don't know. I haven't checked PCD or anything if there's like a top priced one yet. I know it, ideally it's going to be what's going to be best for, because there's no Charizard, no nothing, so it's going to be what's going to be best for the game. Porygon 2, Artillery, Golbat, Larry, Ferrothorn, that Cursed Duster. Ooh, nice Orbeetle. Love that actually. Vanillish Parallel, TMD Devolution, and a Porygon Z. I like that art. Okay. There we are. Roaring Moon. I think that's what it's called. It just came to me. <laughs> so, Roaring Moon pack art, which is pretty cool. And there's that. Quata. Ninja's favorite drink, Vanillish, Onyx, Tinka Tink. Always looking sad. Tells a Tinkaton and it just murders. <laughs> Other Pokemon, Dondazo, Necklai, Gabites. Ooh, and a Frostlass EX. I like that the, the eye is, has its own kind of reflection with it. It makes it look super three dimensional. Absolutely stunning. Uh, speaking of Gabite, there is a Garchomp. I think illustration ran this as well. Pretty excited to see that. Okay, cool. So we're doing pretty good. We're at five and we still have four or five packs in just the first half. So we're trekking quite along. With a little lightning. Yamask, Surskit, that Whismer, Flamigo, love the Flamigo. Cloth. With worm, that crazy Absol, Techno Radar. Ooh, look at that. The parallel on those future cards look stunning. Goodness gracious. Okay. Oh my goodness. So then we got a Porygon Z as the illustration rare in the Milo Take in the back. But look at that. With the neon Pokemon logo and a Pokeball neon. That's a good looking art. The hat that resembles a Porygon, that's really dope. I almost would want one of those. Beautiful cards. So we've got two illustration rares now. Fantastic. So we are, you know, I don't want to jinx anything. We're ahead of the curve. We still got three packs left in this first half and we already got six. So let's see they're gonna maintain it in the second half or we're gonna drop off. <laughs> Oh, hopefully you got that, sorry. Dark energy, let's see. Little Trub, Gimmagool, Wigglet, Tulip, Veluza, Chantal, ooh, Panseer, Simiseer, and a Garganacle. Nice art. So Simiseer and a Panseer back to back. Iron Valiant, oh, I can't wait. The regular full art and the hyper rare looks so good, at least from what I've seen online. I can only imagine they look better in person. Is that a little fire? Okay. Regular Porygon, Seedra, nice. Magby, Vanillite, Simiseer, Crobat. There's the regular Rort, Gorgeist Parallel, Tinka Tink Parallel, and a more Peko. Always looking just menacing. He's up to, up to something. Cool. All right, and we, here we go. Roar and Moon to end the first half. See if we get something in pack number 18. Boom. Leaf. Leave it to me. Ooh, a Jirachi. Naklai. The Parasol Lady. I'm searching. Searching. Garbodor. Future Booster Energy. Screamtail. Chiyu. 
and there's the gold dango secret illustration rare that is absolutely insane looks so good in person too holy cow i hope we can pull the gimmick goal and they literally stack on top of each other that is absolutely stunning so there we go with a secret illustration rare so there is our two gold star hopefully that doesn't mean that's the only one we're gonna get but goodness and that was the end of the first half. yeah man so we're we're moving along all right so now we're in the second half i'll move a little quicker since we've seen quite a few of the common cards Corey swab fancier nickets steamy single four who is it strike i haven't seen that yet flittle either iron jacuus parallel and an iron moth so we got the parallel with the regular iron moth and that looks just as stunning goodness gracious and i keep saying that the art just looks so good don't sleep on this set. Don't do it. <laughs> There's that Garchomp. Terrestrial Garchomp. I wonder if we're gonna get a full art terrestrial one too. I know that happens. Octillery, Golbats, Larry, your mask. Honestly, I'm thinking the Goldango, the reason they probably didn't put a hyper rare because gold on gold would just be so much. Wochian. It would be insane. I think that card looks so good. It's so simple. Goldango number 1,000 on the, if you look at all the Pokedex. I think that's just fantastic. I don't think Pokemon thought too hard about, oh, who are we gonna make do that? Because if you do that, it's just gonna end up being a mess. Gligar people will be like, oh, that's who you pick for 1,000. But I think Goldango is a great, great one. Ambipom, ooh, Snorlax doll. Manfu, Surskit, and a Brute Bonnet. So I haven't seen that one yet. Looks great. And I can't wait to see the promos that come in these ETBs. So that's a nice thing. Um, well, some people might not think it's as nice because you have to buy two. Uh, since there's two different ETBs for the same set, you get two promos, one in each, uh, which is great if you like variety. And it really gives an incentive to buy more. Uh, but those who are not really wanting to spend more than the amount on one, uh, kind of feel like that's not great. Cloth. And at that point, you just pick which art you like better. Mill tank. Ooh, and an iron hands. Looking crazy. I think there's a really nice iron hands illustration rare as well. All right, all right. Already running out of room. I'm gonna have to scooch him down. Okay. So we are at eight hits. There's quite a bit to go. So far, this has been a great box. With a good variety, with a full art trainer. Uh, the only thing we don't have is a regular full art Pokemon yet. We've got the secret illustration rare, a couple of illustration rares, EX, Tatsugiri, Earthen Vessel, I haven't seen that, Glyscar, there's that Gimmagool, and a Chiyu. Okay. I'm wondering if we'll go for the side. Part. I will say it does seem like it's gonna be a little tough to. 100% the set organically uh, but so far from what I've seen with Scarlet and Violet the whole all the sets not just one particular is that a lot of the singles aren't really too bad there's a one or two maybe that kind of hit those peak numbers um, and really they're dropping I know some people will say oh we want one crazy chase card that's gonna be hundreds and hundreds of dollars me honestly don't like that yeah you know, I'd rather maybe it hits let's say at the max 100 but keep everything else Organic enough where everyone's, it's harder to pull. It's still like one in 50, one in 100 packs, but it feels rewarding when you still pull it. Ooh, that's holding on. Maybe there's something great in here. Something great for you on that code. A little fire. Okay. Remoraid. A little Pumpkaboo. Zubat. Natsu. Medical Energy. The Iron Bundle. Glyscar. Nimble. Blitz. And a Zekrom. I can't wait to already see just from this one booster how much of my binder I'm gonna have filled out. I did open one um, booster bundle earlier and I got the Mela full art card. So that was pretty nice. It was the only hit I had in all six packs, but it was a pretty good one. 
So I was not complaining on that. Swab, hands here, nickets, Gligar, that Rourke, Minier, Simapore, that Brute Bonnet, and a Roaring Moon Full Art. There we go. There it is. That looks so good too. So we are, colors kind of um, clash a little bit with the background, but it does look really good. I think there is a hyper rare of this that looks better because it is gold in the back. And we got a full art trainer, not trainer, full art Pokemon. Beautiful. All right, and that Brute Bonnet parallel. Okay, Shark at it, pack art. Just this real quick. Move it up a little bit. Maybe that will help. All right. It's the code. Perfect. You got a purloin. Mianfu, Pharaoh Seed, Gibble, Energy Capsule, Simus Sage, Norman. Oh, didn't mean for it to focus like that. Ooh, that Slithering parallel looks really nice. Going into a Foy Coco parallel. Into a Kingdra. I don't know if we pulled a Kingdra yet. That might be the first one. Okay. So we're getting down to the... I think we're definitely past the 75% on this box. Metal Energy. What a Blip Bug. Fight Coco. Honage. Dwebble. There's a Zip Striker, Crocolore, Ambipom, Yamask, Porygon 2, ooh, and a Latios as a holographic rare. I haven't seen that one yet either. I did hear that Latios is not on the set. And I'm curious, and if any of you know, let me know. Is there ever another set where only one of them is in it? Or has that always been both? Okay. And a little Dark Energy. Penpour, Blitzel, Bounce Sweet, Phoebus, Nice Cyclozar, Toad Scroll, Slither, Spinda, and a Dottler. That's pretty cool. I don't even like Dottler that much, but that looks pretty nice. Thiefel is the Hollow Rare. Nice. It's on a pile of some kind of tree. And it protect. He protect, he attack. If heads are any points next turn, prevent all damage from an effects into this Pokemon. And it's just the Zen headbutt. Nice. So that is three. Yeah, that is three illustration rares. One secret illustration so far. Again, I only usually see one secret illustration in a box. Pull two, that would be insanity. We have reached the point of running out of room, and that is a good thing. Got some room over there. A little fighting energy. Horsey. Joltik. Wild Red. Remoraid. Snorlax Doll. Tinkaton. Durant. Tulip. Steelix. And a Deoxys. They're really bringing out everybody <laughs> for this set. Okay. Chalk Dance. Lightning, Apom, Galvantula, Mantike, Pantsage, TM Devolution, Exploud. There's the Mela. Again, pulled that full art earlier. Gibble, Exploud. Oh, and an Altaria EX. So we just got another hit. So we are at 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 11. So again, I've said on a low end, 11. It's kind of been my lowest amount I've received. That that's pretty good. Twelve again, thirty percent ideal, or thirty three really. And we're about on the. We are on the brink of that. If we can get one more hit, two. More, I definitely just ruined that. There's Tinglu. Let's see if there's something in the parallel spot. It was a Flittle and an Iron Bundle. I don't know what I was thinking there. I think we've already pulled all those. We have four remaining. Okay. Code. Some water. 
Brennan, Snorrant, Nacklestack, Plusel, Minier, Dondazo, Veluza, Pansage, Tandem Mouse, and a Volcanion. Good stuff. So the last three packs, I'm hoping really for anything, you know, anything to help. Obviously, ideally, I would love at least an illustration rare because there's quite a bit of them. Uh, I mean, not that anything. Trainer, hyper, hyper rare would be fantastic too. I actually like the hyper rares in these sets. Sword and Shield, when there's all just the rainbows, I did not like those. Me and Foos, Pharaoh Seed, Gibble, Pancor, Glyscar, Absol, Sim Sage, Rem, Galvanch, and a Serena EX. What did I think? I haven't. I was like, some reason I think I pulled that one. Maybe it was in that box earlier, but that is number 12. That is, that could possibly be our last hit to keep it on just 12, which again, can't be mad about, but we're gonna do a shark at it and then with a Garchomp pack art. Booyah. It's Dotler, Tetoxel, Lipard, Wimpod. TM Blindside, Crocolore, TM Evolution, Masquerain, Wiggler. I feel like it's the first time I've seen that. Ooh, and a Low Kicks. Look at that art. That is fantastic. But that does bring us to our final pack. And again, guys, if you haven't yet, definitely leave a like. Uh, this is pretty good for one box. I'll do a quick recap once I open this. Um, but if you guys haven't yet, definitely subscribe, ring the bell if you want any. Be notified for future videos. Again, we've got two ETBs coming up. Hope me not mess that up. And uh, two more boosters that I'll wait for some friends. Blitzel, Battle Sweet, Phoebus, Apom, Norman, Orthworm, Toad, Simapore, Nickit, and Azatu. I definitely didn't even take the energy out. So we ended with 12 hits, which ideally is where I'm very happy with gather these we've got quite a variety again very nice amounts okay so we have that cofagrigus the Rourk full art so we got one full art there we got a mini air so an illustration sandy shocks ex serena ex so we got two three alteria ex we got this dollar illustration rare, Warren Moon Full Art, Iron Hands EX, that's five. That Goldengo is our biggest hit of the day, being the secret illustration rare. Absolutely stunning. Porygon Z being our third illustration rare. And Frost Last, we had six EXs. That's pretty good. Um, but yeah, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for the future. <laughs> not to be a, a pun, I did not mean that. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Bye bye.